Right, here we go. A repair on an airbox. As you can see, they've stuck something through the side of this airbox. This one's actually off a uh, TRX 500. We're going to be using this here epoxy resin with the hardener. You can pick up at most hardware sh stores. And this here is what they call a glue powder. That's um, pretty good stuff too. I'll show you how that works. Uh, first up, we're just going to well, we'll clean the airbox. There you go, that should do. Now mix the resin up. That's 500 mils and this here's 100 mils, so about 5 to 1. 5 parts the resin to 1 part the hardener. There. Oh, stinks. And a good mix up. This stuff doesn't set very fast, like it's, it's reasonably fast, but not not that fast that you haven't got time to to use it. Alright, now I'll get a bit of our cloth, find a part where we've tucked into it before, use this for quite a few different applications. Off. Don't need that piece. Brush or whatever you want to put this stuff on with doesn't really make too much difference. I'll put a bit over it. Brush is definitely a lot um, cleaner and tidier if you're wanting to make it look look really nice yeah you're better off to use a brush just to make sure that you have it looking nice this has tucked away underneath the bike and you can't see it so a bit of resin floating around here and there is not going to make any difference if anything it'll just make the whole box a little bit stronger anyway that you put a cloth over the top up oh, back and down and cover that crack under there throw a crack just under there fold that up like that and, and just get your your resin and that just flows through it. That'll just soak straight through this and attach itself to the to the box. This is a nice easy fix because we don't have to worry about how it looks but I mean you can get really you can get right into it and and um, make it look really pretty if you want but for this application I'm not too worried about how it looks and you can trim all these edges up later on if you want just with a knife you can cut them off reasonably easy as you can see that's soaked all through that nicely just go over the top of that but And this actually got damaged by a, um, they were putting a calf feeder onto the back of the cord. And um, when they backed up, they forgot to stop, didn't they? 
and the tow bar of the car feeder went right up underneath the bike and um, <laughs> straight into the airbox so, and put a big hole in it. So that was the end of that. And now what we can do, I was telling you about this glue before. You can get this glue and you just pour it. This doesn't affect the setting time. This only makes it thicker. It doesn't doesn't um, yeah as I said it doesn't it doesn't affect the setting time. Even though you can make it really thick and actually um, make it into shapes pretty much. It's real real good stuff to use. It's um, yeah really handy, especially when you're fixing small bits and pieces. About three hours later and she's as hard as all good to go again. So we'll stick that back in and yeah. See from the inside there. You can see there, you can see through it, but solid as.